enough drinks, soup, all black with the cufflinks. Yo, who the hell produced that beat, by the way, yo? Um, that was um, Dre Skull. Dre Skull? Yeah, Dre Skull. Skull. Oh, bro. It's not like it's the same style, but it's like people know when you're on a beat, but you do switch up yeah, yeah. from time to time. Yeah, all the time. Oh, all the time. Okay, all the time. Okay, my bad. Yeah. Whatever beat it is, I'll just work with a beat. You know what I mean? You had so many like situations where you had the UK scene had to prove itself. Then you got the deep voice. Then you had like even getting out of like the UK market back in the days. But now everything is totally reversed. You don't need any other market. You are the market now. You don't have to like, you don't need like OKs from the US to be hot. You know, how does that feel now that you, you have your own fan base? Like the UK supports UK artists. I came from an era where, you know, nobody was supporting UK artists when I used to go there like 20 years ago and shit. Yeah, yeah. So how does that feel now? Yeah, it feels good, but obviously there's still loads of work to do, you know what I mean? You still have like, oh, there's still work to do? No. Yeah, of course. Yeah, like, like of 100,000 so. people at the Wire Festival. How much more work do you want? Yeah, but I need to, I need to get in America, though. <laughs> you, um, you came out here, and uh, I'm, I'm so happy that you've been out here for a couple of weeks. I, I know you've been in the studio. I see you with Davies. Yeah. I see you with Meek Mill, a couple of cats out here. How, how's that coming along? Like, Yeah, no, man, it's just, to be honest, it's been so long since I ain't been allowed here. Like 10 years, you know what I'm saying? So man's just here, just enjoying America, just taking and being here. You know what I mean? Like, come yeah. man, proper misty. You get me? On your Instagram, I see you linked up with um, your brother, and it's more than just a uh, artist feature relationship. You were with Drake, that's like a brother to you. Yeah. And on the internet, they're calling it a power meeting, but I know it was like a family. Yeah. Like, yeah. Nah, no, it's just a man there getting a the food. You know yeah. what I mean? How was it? How was it to link up with him again? Like after all the COVID shit. Yeah, nice. Like, it's nice, it's good, man. I ain't seen that man for like, like two years or something. Wow, you know but is this on the phone? You just like chopping yeah, it like, off? Yeah, like man, I just be like, oh, what's going on? But then because of the time difference and that, sometimes you don't talk for months because it's like, when I'm awake, they're sleeping, vice versa, you know what I mean? So you just don't even speak. That's so, crazy. Like, so even now... Even like me and you, like, you know what I'm saying? Like sometimes yeah. you will hit me Man, we'll hit you way later and vice versa. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, so I gotta wait either you, for you to wake up yeah, or. Like, so, yeah. And then when you hit me, I'm knocked out. Yeah, yeah. So then you just stop talking. Uh, speaking of a legend, uh, he just won uh, uh, an Oscar. Yeah, big up, Daniel Kaluuya. He's like a UK legend, like, you know, or. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, he's a legend. He's a legend. But for, for us, that's, that's the family, you know what I mean? So it feels like you won an Oscar when you see that he yeah, won. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and no, I was excited. Bro, because the last time I saw him was with you at your concert. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You, you know, it's it's crazy that even him, like, I'm, like, shocked even him. Like, he's like, who, kid? Like, even the biggest boxers, they'd be like, who, kid? I, I'm bugged out how every walks of life in the U.K., knows the who kid chant which yeah, is like bugged out to be yeah, that was a legendary era bro you know what oh i mean everyone knows that do you remember where you were at when you were like yo i'm about to get it cracking with my mixtape or or i'm about to start my new record or do you remember the first time you were in the studio and how was that yeah who, who was in the studio with you like which, which homies was, was with you um the man and my brothers everyone like, you remember that day like what was the first record do you remember yeah that was like it was that that was like a UK music is that called Garage. So it was, a bit, <laughs> it was it. So it was you like, have that record? Where is that song? I doubt it. <laughs> it so it was like so it was like grime, but they used to call it they didn't call it grime then. Like I made like a couple of tracks. Mm. Then I went jail for like a little while. Then I came out, then I just went to hip hop. So what, was it like the experience of being in jail listening to shit or cause you were like stationary yeah, or listening to Buck. Then time Buck used to rap. What? Yeah. You used to rap dogs? Yeah, yeah Buck. Yeah, Buck. Buck. Put that camera on this guy. <laughs> this is the guy that influenced gigs right there, man. Get the fuck out of here, yo. Yeah, but Buck used to be hard, but what? and I used to be like, this shit, these tracks that I'm making, they, they sound whack, but I need, to, I need to get on that the hard hip hop shit. You get me? Then that was it. I came out, then it was that then. But kind of left it for a while because he focused more on the acting. But does the film as well, isn't it? Mm. You know what I'm saying? So 
then man just carried it on. It's crazy because uh, back then when you were locked up, I think the Jada Kisses and you know all those hard like the Biggies and the, you know there was it was a lot of new the New York scene was like lit. Yeah, when and I was locked up, that was the time when. That's what I'm saying. All them tunes that like, get shut the fuck and that oh, 50. All the mixtape shit. Yeah, that was that the exact time. I remember I went I went to there was a jail that I went to and you couldn't get no music. So I didn't hear no music for like how long was I there? Like four months I was in that jail. I was going crazy, like, oh this guy. Then I got then I got them to move me. Then when they moved me, I heard um I could hear from a man, so get shot in the foot. And I was like, right. what is that? That's sounding crazy. I was, all, I was all moving closer to the man's cell, like listening, like, you get me? Yo. And I phoned Buck. I said, Buck, I need everything. I don't know what it was. It was some who kid shit, some new 50 and that. I heard some lock shit. Like, what? Them, t- them time is D block. And that's when, I, that's when I first heard like JR Ratter and all that. That time, the like. Dipset shit. Yeah, yeah, you get me? Like, it's funny because that's the. Uh, you. Went crazy off of my favorite mixtape. Yeah. It was Mad Guns, Killing, everything was in that shit. But yeah. Get Shot the Fuck Up was like, yo, we couldn't even perform that shit. Yeah, that was crazy, bro. I'm sure I you remember had... I was in my cell wheeling out bad times. Like, nah. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy because now that you absorbed that element and you took it to your own shows, now you understood why we can control like some of the fans. Like Some of the music just caused... Yeah, that, yeah, that must have been like, crazy. It was like, <laughs> you know, we got banned too. I'm sure you were getting banned in the UK. We yeah. were going through that shit also, but did you know the day you knew you you controlled the streets? You remember that day? Like, nah. yo, we got it, man. Yeah. Yo, man. Yeah, nah, I don't control any streets. I mean, I, I mean, you know what I mean, like music wise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nowhere near gangster. I'm just making clear. I'm not gangster. This is a total hip hop interview. Yeah. But <laughs> Nah, but whoa, wait. Whoa, whoa, you know? Yeah, I know. I want no problems, man. This is a totally hip hop oriented interview, man. You ran every town with your music. Yeah. Do you remember that day? Like you were like, yo, I got this shit. Yeah, nah, it, was, it wasn't more like I got this. It was like, fuck it, this is crazy, bro. Like, mm. Do you know what I mean? Like The hardest was the record where, that, like, that where, day. Where man come from? Man went shit, blood, you know what I mean? Then people are listening to man's music all over. I was like, this is it's crazy. So your 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 history is just like us. Freestyles, your freestyles big you up. Yeah. It's just like little baby. Little baby's freestyle started him up. And he's big out here. I feel like you 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 have the DNA of like the underground. Like you need to fucking pop off to get over the hump. Yeah. And then once you saw like me, I learned about you by DJing the clubs. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, who the fuck like the hardest? Oh, when you, you when you was DJing when in I London. was DJing the clubs, like you know, every time we did like top of the pops and all that shit, I had to DJ the clubs in the evening. Whatever, what was that? China White, remember all them clubs oh, yeah, back yeah. in the days yeah, and shit. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. I, that's I think I saw like British chicks like throwing coke on my chest and all. Kind. I was like, oh, what are you doing? Like you know what I'm saying? Like it was crazy back then. But and you know, and you know the craziest thing, we, <laughs> we we weren't even allowed in them clubs. Like <laughs> nah, so, yeah. So you gonna go to them shits? Nah, they don't let us in. Nah, like China, like China White was huge back then. Yeah. So how was the drink thing, man? How, how, how was it to like link up with them again, man? The yeah. photos is everywhere. Yeah, I saw no, some cool yeah, ass no, pics and that stuff. Was, that was good, man. Nice to see them. Look. Cause think, it's not even just Drake. It's like all of them, like the them. whole clique. Yeah, like oh. Chubbs, Pippin, Rocks, all of them. Do you know what I mean? Like, like it, it, is that gonna lead to more music, or I mean, or is it still organic? Like you guys, yeah, just, that's Drake a, is the type of guy that be like, yo, I'm ready to go in now. Yeah, that's just like same with any, anything in it. Like mm. if you if if a musician is your your brother or, or your brethren or whatever, like you know, it's not like oh yes, make music all the time. You yeah. know, what I mean? like if it happens, it happens. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. and it, But I like the fact that he, um, like, he regulated to, like, link up with you and saw that you're in the U.S. Yeah. You know, like, you know, there's not a lot of people that's, like, on some friendship cool shit like that. It's yeah, strictly yeah. business. Like, yeah. I need you for a feature. Yeah. I need you to help me with my streaming. Yeah. I need to fucking pop off and make yeah. money from the shit. And yeah. that's it. Yeah. But, but that's you, my guy, but it's not even just straight. Everyone's been showing yeah. mad love, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, man run into me yesterday like, you know what I mean like, everyone's just like yeah gigs you're in the US nah like let's link you know what I mean isn't it crazy because your circle is hard to get in you have a very tight circle same people like for like years same motherfuckers yeah. even when I go there same guys yeah. it's hard to get in but 
the rappers that do get in become family members and yeah, yeah, the cool. same thing goes from like here when you come here you hang with them here you but it's nice out. to finally see like them on this side mm. you know what I'm saying like in like where they live and show it man like how they live here and like just different things as well like you know like that like silly shit like I don't know like like pancakes <laughs> like <laughs> you know what I'm saying you get me like in, in London like they don't really eat pancakes all the time but I yeah. love pancakes you get me <laughs> yeah so, you gotta so like they have like they just have pancake day so you what? yeah like you have pancake day and you have pancakes one day of the year like <laughs> it's, it's like an event like <laughs> but here it's regular it's just breakfast you know what I'm saying like so I mean, the only thing I, I never understood about London is the beans, man. Y'all be putting beans on toast. Yeah, that's like, for us, that's like poverty rehearsal, right? Yeah, that's but like, that's where it comes from, though. Yeah, from, oh, that's from, from being poor. Yeah, that comes from being poor. That's like, like, that's like yeah. us eating spaghetti with hot dogs. Yeah, you know, yeah see, but, we that, but that's not on the menu, though. Like, nigga, we ain't going to no fucking restaurant ordering spaghetti and hot dogs, right? Like, Yeah, but maybe someone who came from the streets brought that to restaurants, like. You know what I'm saying, like, bro? But it'd be like toast, and it'd be wet. Fam, as when man, when you, when there's no food in the house, yeah, and yeah. there's bread and beans, you're gonna make it work, fam. Bro, it's like, <laughs> you know it's Ireland. That shit is, bro, I was in Ireland. They gave me that shit. I was like, yo, I can't even pick it up because it was so wet. It was like ripping the toast. Like, but man will do that as well. Man will do like a bread spaghetti and like hot dog. Oh well, yeah, well. and, and chop it. that hot dog up like and make it work, yeah. make it last. <laughs> <laughs> Talking the hardest uh, was like the, the the I guess the the shit that started it all, huh? Like, how was that? Like, you know, when you finished doing that freestyle, did you guys know that that was gonna be like the biggest fucking shit out of here? Like, nah, bro. And then you hit me up for the mixtape, and then it was a rap after that. I, I didn't even know what was going on. I'm in I'm in New York, like you know, everybody's calling me, yo, this UK shit popping. Uh. But yeah. I was like on Hot 97. I played on Hot. Which is kind of like cool to do that because you see how there's like other DJs here that support you and shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I, I think uh, uh, Rosenberg, he be playing our shit. Yeah. There's a lot of motherfuckers out here that be fucking with the UK scene. But Toronto, hands down, you need to go to Toronto, man. I don't know why you're not over there. You're yeah. like God over there. Yeah, yeah I'm going to go there. I just got here. Just about got here. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yo, shout out to DJ Marshmallow. Like, I played that earlier. Like, I, yeah. how was that really? He hit you up, or how was that? Was that a Swiss beast nah, thing? Um, yeah, me and St. John. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, St. John, we played that in the studio. And he said, yeah. No, no, I think he made it on the spot. Wow. Yeah, yeah, and no, he made it on the spot still. And then, yeah, man just jumped on it. Like, yeah. What? Yeah. Just like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he put it out, leaked it? Nah, and then Marshmallow... And um, Southside made a beat or something for it. That is that is like so random and rare. Like yeah. you have Southside and fucking Marshmallow. Yeah, yeah. I think they're made, making beats together or something. Mm. This nigga be having videos where he's like a giant, like he's like walking over cities and shit. I love those. I love the fucking ads you used to do, man. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Just, just great. Whose idea was that? Uh, mine. Oh, those all your ideas right there. And who who's the artist that does his artwork like? All those cartoon joints of you is crazy, man. Ooh. Yeah, there's different ones. There's okay. Different. Yeah, 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 there's a couple. Art Goon. Um, there's Good. a few guys still. Got the big bad promo, man. That shit was crazy. When you were like going through the shit, like <laughs> yeah, the King yeah, Kong yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah, that was mad. Yo, this shit was like, this shit was everywhere out here. <laughs> yo, and you, yo, for for a guy who raps like yourself, you have like, I mean, you have all the women out there too, man. All the women fuck with you, like. They yeah. fuck with your bar, your bars, lyrics. I, you know, I never thought the day that I know. I know maybe you didn't think that. Maybe you know guys would be reciting your bars, but women know your bars. Like, is is girls in the UK more gangster than girls out here? I don't know. Everybody no, but the girls out here, they love gangster music. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> you know what I mean? That's. I need to get into the girls out here. Okay. First. Trust me. That's what. That's what? why I need to get into start getting some bangers here, fam. I don't know, man. Like, you be having like bad bitches at your shit, man. Buff baddies, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Man, mate, man, man, talk to the girls though as well in the music, you know. Oh, so you, like, you that's what I'm saying, yeah, them. like buff baddies. Yeah, that's me, like honoring them, like you know what I'm saying, like yeah. Every every man, album you got, you have a record. That's me that, paying them homage. Yeah, you know? <laughs> buff baddies. I like, I, yo, I love his his scenario videos. He always has his click with him, and he gets off the car. You know, he's like, you know. <laughs> 
<laughs> you know that when you got a nigga tied up? You always got some nigga tied up. You know what I'm saying? Who are Is there like a subliminal message behind that shit? Yo, you always got some nigga tied up. Like, yo, you know that? who the hell is this guy that's tied up, yo? Hey, you're fam, fam, you're dumb, up. fam. I know you guys are communicating with these losers out there, man. Recent, every video someone's tied up. <laughs> This man chat shit, blood. <laughs> Before you even disappear, because this studio is hot as fuck. Like, what the fuck is going on in here, man? This is like some hot ass pussy, man. I feel like I miss some rapper bitch's ass or something, man. What the fuck is this, man? So, uh, um, <laughs> is that fucking, is that fucking uh, uh, yeah. What would be the bucket list for gigs? You in America, like, a girl hook. Like, what female hook you would want? You want to put it in the air? Um, we get these uh we get these bugs. These are like fan fan questions by the way. I don't know man, there's loads. You got yeah. her, you got her, but, you got uh Man like the classics are like Mary J and oh, that, like okay. them, you know what I'm saying? Like you get me? New producers <coughs> this year, you still uh, are you keeping all the, the, the same producers you fuck with or are you are you branching out since Yeah, no, nah, I mean I work with whoever's got a bag. You were, who who are you working with the other day? Like is there a big producer I heard you were fucking with? Like or or it was just like uh, Fam, man, whoever's got a banger, fam, man will work with, bro. I don't care. Like, you know what I mean? I gotta get Everyone you. starts from somewhere, like, you know what I'm saying? Before they're big. Mm. Like, the, the, yeah, bang, the bangers big. are still bangers, like, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, you're, but you're big. Uh, you need to be. Man <laughs> said, yeah, but you're big. Yeah, what the fuck is this nigga talking about? Yo, you gotta <laughs> fucking work with, like, Murder Beats or something. Murder Beats and you? Um, I done a tune with Murder one time. Oh wow! Yeah, See, yeah. Yeah, I done couple. I done couple. Big, I done couple like, tunes. Like, huh? I done couple tunes with Murder. Yeah, but you see what I'm saying? Like mm. even me, like me, like if, if like in my head, I want to. Yeah, sell. but then like Buff Baddies, like that's a banger. But mm. the, the kid that made that, he was on. I see him on Instagram, bro, and he just sent me a beat. Like I don't even know him, and yeah. he's 16. <laughs> you know, yeah, and that's a banger. And that tune there is ringing off in London.